opportunity to clear my name. Today's just another step in the process of doing that. Um, until October, when it will come up again, uh, it's business as usual, as far as I'm concerned. So um, that's where we're up to at the moment. I guess there's a concern you draw about how long this can go on until you are an elected member of parliament. Of course, uh, the sooner the better, but uh, it, it runs its course and there's not much I can do about that. So all I can do is uh, maintain my innocence, uh, which I've done from day one, uh, and in the meantime, um, continue to represent the people of Mount Canterbury best I can. There's lots of issues that we're dealing with uh, in parliament, and uh, like I've said, uh, I completely deny the allegations and uh, I'm actually looking forward to the opportunity to um, get my story out there and, uh, and clear my name. So that will come in due course. I guess you've been in Parliament for a little while now with this hanging over your head. How has it affected your role as an elected member? It hasn't affected at all. Um, we've been able to achieve very good things for the uh, region of Mount Gambier and continue to work on all those issues. Uh, the 10 year ban on fracking. Um, you know, there's, there's a number of issues that are coming up in terms of our health boards um, that uh, will just continue business as usual and um, whilst this is not pleasant, uh, it's something that I'm 100% confident that uh, I'll be able to clear my name and, and move forward. Look forward to that opportunity. Is there a message you'd like to give to that area of people? Oh, I think that uh, the support's been overwhelming and, uh, you know, as as far as I'm concerned, I work every day as hard as I can for the people of Mount Gambit. And I'm very proud of what we achieved with uh, the Independent Learning Centre. Um, so uh, lots of people have you know, finished their year 11 and 12, lots of um, staff are employed, and uh, I look forward to uh, putting that all on the table when the time's right. So thanks very much.